Hello and welcome back to module number two, uh, video number two. And in this video, I'm going to talk about software application in the form of HTML. I'm going to talk about FTP, and then I'm going to talk to you how we going to upload um, your files into the server using the FTP. So let's start with basic. One of the things that I often I recommend to students is let's use simple template just to have a sense what it is in tell. And when you create a, tempo, a template or download the template, it's usually give you a sense of what it is and what it, it try. If we look at um, w3schools.com, they have a, a large selection of template and if you will apply that for example you see the demo you will see the band and something that might be of interest to you i in my case i use uh, a template uh, that i've been using for a long time and in this case it's not very sexy but it does the work um so where is it and this is the template so one of the things that you will need to apply and when you download the template to your desktop is to clean up and to revise it and to make it your own. And how do you do that? You're going to use the tools that I was talking about, the HTML tools that allowed you to do that. There's two options. One is Adobe Dreamweaver and the other one is basically an editor that is dedicated to programming PHP and so on. If you are into design, I highly recommend that you will use Adobe because it has a more interface that allowed you to see the interface inside of it, but also to see the, 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 uh, the, the code inside. The, 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 the other option is to see the code and every time you're going to save and uh, see if that you can see the, the work that you are doing in your HTML browser. One of the things that I concentrate in this module is the idea of casting style sheet. That help us to design the, the, the outline in order for us to have a consistent look to the website itself. The outline in this case, and I got um, I shared with you my own work in this case is a layout, which means that it has a body, it has div ID, which is the page, and it has a header, and it has a bar, and it has all the components of a head, um, the casting style and what it is consist of. Why is it helpful? Because if your website is a large scale website, this referring to it in the HTML will give you consistency with regard to your index file, which means in this case, it will give you ability to insert the content and be able to apply it in order for you to see what it is it entail with regard to the design aspect and again this is why the for me Dreamweaver can be easy maybe a good start for you using HTML and apply it so in this case I will I'm going to look at the style sheet and what is it entail and I cover that in the module itself so you save it and the, usually the save consists of index.html. This is something that I want you to be aware of because the names that you give is something that you need up later on to upload to the server in order for you to present it in the server environment. So that's where we are going to talk about the FTP. This is a, a, a transformer a transformation software that allowed us to apply. So the host is ftpupload.net 
And when you created the website, if you log on to the website uh, structure, it will give you your username and your password. It's not something that you generate. It is usually the machine generate for you. So in this case, I am using the password, a username and password that they provide me in order for me to upload. So it will wait and give me a message. And here it is. So basically in the server, they hold on a second. I'll do zoom in. Um, so you will be able to see it uh, better. Hold on uh, ta -ta 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 -ta. full screen. So you will see that it's the, the web, the HTML consists of those images. So if you lip, uh, uh, click on it, it will give you two pages, uh, two files, index to and files from your web. Basically, it gives you a template that they public generate with casting style to all the new members. What you're going to do is you're going to take the files that you created. Hold on, I'm just maneuvering here and I am going to pull away all the windows that I have opened and the website. Hold on. Uh, pa -pa -pa -pa. Here it is. And I'm going to drag all those icons directly to the website. So basically it will replace the index2.html and it will give you the layout that you are asking. So you just drag everything out into the page in order for you to do that. I did not do that because it's still too early, but I will do that the day that I will post this video. So basically you will see that in live action. And the idea here is that using the browser using the browser to test to make sure that everything is synchronized and everything there is no mistakes is part of your job as a, a web developer to apply and to make sure that everything is intel you will have my template in canvas so you will be able to see what it is and you will be able to create your own first page using a template or you do, if you don't like a template you can use something from your own that's okay with me too and just start the idea of thinking about your project thinking about what does it means to have a website that you can present your work your assignment and everything about you in a way that accessible to everyone to see so that's it for my module. I hope you enjoy it. Again, if you have any questions, please do not hesitate to ask. Until next time, have fun.